Hello everybody, it's a long time since I've done a video like this, obviously it's Daniel here, and I've got a few things I need to go through, well, of relative importance, so I'll try and crack on and get it done fairly quickly. Now, the first thing people will be asking, now, why have you not done any videos, and although I've said it, I'll mention it again, obviously the capture card problem, short-circuited and electrocuted me, I'm fine, don't want to drag on about it, because it sounds like I'm getting a sympathy vote, which I don't actually want. Now, well, hopefully, because it's my birthday on the 4th, again, I don't want to plug that, ignore it if you need be, but I'm hoping that on that day I might get a capture card as a present from the parents. You never know. I have referred to it a couple of times. And um, I can only really hope, because after all, capture cards on the whole are not that cheap, and I've had previous with easy caps, and I'm not going anywhere near them ever again, because long story short, that was horrendous. It made horrible sized files that took about 18 years to record and then decided that it wasn't properly compatible with YouTube or with actually its own editing software. Don't really know, but that's what happens when you pay six quid for a recording device. Now, the um, link to the uh, 4th of June, however, is... I know a couple of people have PM me varying amounts of time ago about um, whether I, I'd be able to sort of set up a list for battling over the summer. Now, due to the fact that the capture card didn't work, I chose to temporarily ignore them. Don't worry, I don't. Ign I'm not ignoring you because I hate you or anything like that. I just don't know, and I'd rather only message people back when I know for sure what's going to happen. So, um, if I don't get a capture card, that may be put on hold. If I do, I shall try and set something up. Now, this is something I want to bring on straight away because it's related to the both PMs and you know what's quite relevant and trendy at this point in time is that some people still think Gen 4 is better than Gen 5 and you know, vice versa, some people say that dinosaurs need to move on, stop living in the past. Now, for me personally, at the moment I only have one team for Gen 5 and I don't particularly like it. I mean, it has a lot of things about it that I need to tweak. Basically, I just made a pass of some things that I found quite interesting and threw them all at the same pass and hoped they'd work. And there's a bit of chemistry going on there, but to be honest, it wasn't very good. Now, the problem for that, I suppose, is that obviously with tiering for Gen 5, it's still all over the place, and there's a lot of balancing that needs to go on. So, um, for now, uh, I kind of have the preference still towards Gen 4, especially because of the PBR concept, because the DS Wi-Fi, and this is something that I will link into a frequently asked questions section, although um, obviously the 5th Gen has tried to get random baffling and has in, in, attempted to improve its Wi-Fi connection, it's still pretty shit from what I can see. A lot of people are disconnecting frequently and this is compounded when obviously the majority of the people that I am going to be associating with because of the nature of the internet are sort of Americans, Canadians, Mexicans, some Australians, some Kiwis, all of which are thousands upon thousands of miles away so that makes the disconnection even more likely very few people are from, well this is quite surprising, there are a few but not that many come from obviously the UK, Germany, Netherlands, all nations that have quite a strong affinity with the English language within Europe for a plethora of reasons. So yeah, put that on hold for a bit, the 4th and 5th gen thing, I still have a slight preference for 4th maybe because I've not fully immersed myself into the 5th generation yet. Um, the only other reason is that PBR you can play in very high level of comfort. You can have a big TV if you have one, plug your weed to it so you can sit down in comfort with proper remote, well I'll say proper remote, a handheld remote shall we say, so you don't have to lurch over your DS like this with your stylus and your big forearms getting in the way. I'm not keen on that. I'm much comfier and happier playing on the Wii than the DS, especially for something that requires a lot of attention. Now I'll move on to the frequently asked questions bit now, and it tags on to what I've just said. I now have DS Wi-Fi to a degree, not entirely. Will you battle? Will I battle you? Or obviously they'd say, will you battle me? Um, the short answer is no. The long answer is perhaps, but only in the very, very unusual, very oddly specific circumstances. Because I think this is actually something in a video that Xerxes may have put out very recently, that really, really long video, I'll, I'll link to it if I can remember. But, um, like him, I do not spend every waking moment of my life playing Pokemon. I may run a Pokemon clan, but usually all I do there is moderate the chat. 
I'm not much, me a particularly uh, common battler there. Uh, not really surprising, considering. I mean, if with anything really for me, especially if I do anything that's the same for too long, I get bored to death. Not because I have some type of attention deficit disorder, just because I like variation in what I do. In that I would not just keep eating cake for an entire day. I'd like to spread a cake up over different times of a day, a week, or a month. Assuming it didn't go out a day, that's probably not the best example. But yes. Let's get on to the second question. Will I record anything on a DS? Is the question that actually I get asked surprisingly frequently, considering I've never done so and never ever seen like I ever would. But I'll answer the question, it's been asked enough times. Um, I would, if I could, is the short answer. The long answer is that I do not have a digital camera, I do not use an ACE card. The only time I use ROMs is when I physically can't find a game that I want to have a look at. Normally they're quite old games, so they'll be games that are worth pence rather than pounds that have been discontinued for some like 10, 15 years and you'd never have any hope of finding one. So um, that's the only time I'd ever use ROM. Um, ideally what I'd want is a digital camera to record, because I quite like the, um, it's almost like, I suppose it's rustic appearance of some videos that are on DS, especially Wi-Fi battles, I prefer them actually when they're on digital camera because I think they've got a bit more character to them. But digital cameras are expensive, so obviously I do not have one of those, as you can probably tell by the quality of this webcam. Um, that also refers me on to something, you know when I got lots of hate about having a donation page set up for PayPal and everything and everyone would, oh you're terrible, no one will ever donate, uh, you're wrong. I do have over a tenner in there now, which isn't a ton, but every little helps. Thanks, Sasha! But, um, yeah, like I said, that money will still be used. If anything goes there, it'll be used entirely for YouTube footage, recording, editing, you know, something along those lines. I mean, you, you've always got a continuous improvement system with technology. Stuff always gets better, so it's always good to reinvest in things that are better. Um, final question that I'll put in my FAQ for now, because I don't want this to go on for an eternity, is people asking me about the Wii 2 and whether I know anything about it. Again, the short answer there is no, but obviously if you've got a brain inside your skull, you can probably see of late that the Wii's price has been slashed at almost all retailers, and that is a massive sign that the second Wii, or whatever you call it, is in the development stage because that's what happens to all consoles. I mean I think it's gone down something like 60 quid here in the UK which is about just short, oh, it should be around 100 US dollars at this point in time. So um, I can't tell you any specifics because frankly if you want to know about specifics you would go to a Nintendo based website and not to me or to any other YouTuber for that fashion unless they work for Nintendo in which case have a job please. Um, but yep, yeah, I want to leave you with, it's not really a question of the day or anything like that, it's just more a question I want to know an answer to or maybe your opinion on, is that obviously YouTube and quite a lot of other social networking sites are a big sort of potential for trolling and I want to actually know, um, some of you probably know more than I do because I'm obviously going to give a biased account because I am me. Um, why I seem personally, and quite a few others, but I need to ask about myself, why I seem such a massive troll target. Uh, I'm not particularly bothered about it, to be honest. I mean, the fact that I'm trolled shows that people find me interesting enough to actually attempt to annoy and harass. But I find it quite interesting, because I don't quite understand it, in that, yes, I may have once plugged that I like Formspring, I may have occasionally mentioned that I have a Twitter account. I may constantly refer to the fact that I run a chat room which is related to the clan I referred to earlier and obviously my YouTube footage I don't mince what I think so obviously that's going to make me a bit of, tar bit of a target there but what have I specifically done other than potentially the uber hate but it, they, they don't even troll me over that anymore because I thought that would have been the cause but I don't think it is. Um, and for the record, I don't hate Ubers, I just don't like them being used alongside everything else, because I don't think it's fair. But um, just ask your opinion, why am I such 
a seemingly well, I'm not an easy troll target, I'm just an attractive troll target. If I was an easy troll target, I'd be crying to you and going, oh boo hoo, it's terrible, and I don't really give a toss, to be honest. But more than anything else, it's just annoying having to either delete comments, block you, block users, rather, uh, delete form spring questions, or mock them, as the case may be. So I just want to know why you think that's the case. Maybe it might be the same reasons why you might perhaps be trolled. So put why you're trolled down, and maybe that will, you know, sort of mix and match. You never know. But anyway, I feel I've been talking for too long now, and I shall leave you with that. Um, I hope this has been informing for you. And I obviously know, because this is a video of me talking, that about a tenth of the people will watch it, that I've actually, um, and would normally watch my PBR video, so... Please do feel compelled to comment, because there won't be a lot of you, I assume, watching this video. So, um, yeah, peace out, everyone. Have a great summer. That's one thing I want to say on the end. Obviously, most schools will be breaking up now. Most universities end about now. Um, so, yeah, enjoy your few months off. I know I will. Catch you later.